welcome back to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed then what are you doing so I'm gonna do a get to know me tag before I really like get into the fashion hauls and all those type of stuff so I know y'all really want to like get to know me so that's what I'm about to answer a few questions so I looked up these questions online and I'm about to just really answer a few of them it's really hot so dope if I'm going like this it's, I'm hot and I hope y'all like my hair Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> um let me see where are they I have so many tab tabs open Let's get into this video. Question number one, where am I from? I am from Jamaica, so I'm from the islands. How old am I? I am 19 years old. Um, where am I from? I just said that. Didn't I just say that? <laughs> Do I have any pets? I have a dog named Lucy. She's been with us since four years now. Um, what is my biggest accomplishment? Yo, my biggest accomplishment is graduating right now. It's graduating from high school. That's like the biggest one for me right now. I haven't really accomplished anything else, but like right now it's that. So... Um, what is your eye color? My eye color is brown. I don't know if you can tell, but I have brown eyes. Um, who is my favorite celebrity? My favorite celebrity would be Queen Naja right now, even though, like, now I'm not gonna say she's not a celebrity, she's a celebrity because all y'all people is recognizing her and her music. So, I'm gonna give that to her. Um, what is your favorite color? My favorite color would be, I don't know if y'all could tell, but like, pink. I don't, I can't even tell. Like, look. Like, see? It would be pink, purple, blue, white. Those are my major, major favorite colors. Um, what is your favorite ice cream? Favorite ice cream? Vanilla. Always, 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 always will be vanilla. Never gonna change. What is your favorite snack? My favorite snack, you can ask anybody, my favorite snack would be the grandma cookies. Them, the white little cookies that come in the blue, the blue bags, those are my favorite. Those are the grandma cookies. Um, what is your favorite time of day? My favorite time of day is nighttime because nobody bothers me at nighttime. I be in my bed watching Netflix, like, I'm not a morning person at all, so that's my favorite time. What is your favorite way to pass time? Favorite way to pass time would just be either on the phone with my friends or watching TV, watching Netflix. Those are my favorite way to pass time. Um, your favorite restaurant? My favorite restaurant. My favorite restaurant would be probably be BBQs. I don't go I don't go to I don't go out to eat like that, but it would probably be BBQs. What is your favorite social media? Your favorite social media would be would be Snapchat. At the moment it would be Snapchat, yeah. Um What was my favorite subject in high school, in school in general? My favorite subject was English. English will forever be my favorite subject. It was, I found it so easy just to learn because it's English, y'all should like, English is English, y'all should know this. 
what was my least favorite subject in school? Math. <laughs> Hands down was math. And then came, then it would come social study, then science. But math will always be, I always hated math, hated it. What do you love about your favorite TV show? At the moment, I don't actually have a favorite TV show because I'd be on Netflix more. But if it would, if it was like, oh, what was your favorite? What would, what, uh, what was your favorite Netflix show? It would probably be Wentworth right now. If y'all haven't seen Wentworth, y'all need to check that out because that's a good ass show. My friend Diamond put me on. I'm giving her her little shout out right now. So Diamond, thank you for putting me on to Wentworth. That is a really good show. It may start off boring, but it really is interesting. Are you a dog person or a cat person? I'm a dog person. Well, I'm kind of both, but I'm more more likely a dog person. Um, are you a good cook? Yes, I am. I'm a great cook. I'm an amazing cook. I have two cookbooks that I bought. Never used it never 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 use it now i wish i had my money back for those i had them and never used it usually i just come up with usually i just make what comes out into my mind really next i don't know what question we at but we just gonna keep it rolling um who was the first person you called I don't know what that means, but I don't really call none of my friends. My friends call me. I don't call them. They call me, all right? Um, okay, these are not questions to ask. Do you remember your dreams? Some yes and no. Do you spell the color as gray or gray? Okay, they're asking, do I spell the color gray or gray? It's two different ways to spell gray. I spell it G-R-A-Y. Yeah, I think. Do you prefer that people shoot, shoot straight with you or temper their words? Be straightforward with me. If you're talking to me, be straightforward with me. Don't just like mix up your words. Just go, just go direct. Do I have a favorite book? No, I do not. Do I remember reading any book right now? No, I do not. Since I left high school, I haven't read nothing really. I haven't read no types of books, which is a shame, but like, uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't remember reading any book, good books. Um, I answered that already. Do you hold any conversations that would be willing to die for? No. Not really. Do you have a best friend? If so, who? No, I do not have a best friend. I do not have a girl best friend or a boy best friend. So, and I'm looking for one actually, but everybody seems to be day room nowadays, but it's all right. Um, who was your first celebrity crush? First, first celebrity crush would be Zac Efron from High School Musical. Oh my God, he was so fine back then. He's I don't know how he looked. I haven't seen him in a while make any videos or anything in a while. Um, what is your zodiac sign? My sign. I'm a Libra. So you know what? Just Come, come get you a girl. That's a Libra. <laughs> um, I'm gonna ask myself. Well, I know the answer to this one. Um, where would I go if I had like an option to leave the city right now? Where would I go? Uh, damn, I don't know the answer to this. Where would I go? Actually, if I had the option to leave like right this very moment, I'm going. I would go to LA. Then from LA, LA, I'm going to. I'm going. I'm going to Europe. I'm going to Paris. 
I'm going all over. If I get the chance to leave, I'm going all over. I don't want to be in one place for too long. Like, I want to go all over. I want to go to everywhere. Paris, Europe, China, Japan, all of that. Um, how many countries have you been to? I've been to five countries. I've been to South Carolina, Virginia, Texas, Oh my God, Florida, damn. I don't remember the other one. I know I've been to five countries because I've been on vacation with my families and we all went to those countries together. So, how many oceans have you swam in? Like 10 or even more? Yeah, like 10 or, no, not even 10. Like, probably like five, five oceans I've been to. Um, how many rings before you answer the phone? One. It depends on who it is. All right, so if you, if you like, if you one of my great friends, I will let it ring one time and then I really pick up. As soon as your name pop up on my screen, I'm answering the phone. If you're not that important, I'll let you ring like three, four times, then I'll pick up the phone. How old was I when I found out Santa wasn't real? Probably like 13. I really don't remember, but I'm probably going to guess 13. But we all know that Santa it wasn't real, so. How old were you when you rode your, when you learned to ride your first bike? 14. I learned at 14 and then forgot how to ride my bike when we moved. And then I had to relearn it again. I don't know how you forget to ride a bike. Yo. Um, what else can I say? Do I need to answer anything else? I think I got all the basics. Yeah, I got all the basics. Now I'm gonna answer this. Where do you buy your jeans? Me, for me, for a plus size girl, I buy my jeans at Rainbow and Forever 21. If you go anywhere else but those stores, they're not gonna have your size. Let me be real with y'all, they're not gonna have your size. So you really gotta shop at those certain stores unless you go online. Mostly online, they will have your size, but like when you go inside the store, they don't have your size. So Rainbow and Forever 21 are the best stores to go to for plus size girl. Other than that, they sell a pair of skinny girl jeans, a pair of skinny girl clothes. Like, they need to open up a freaking store for plus size girls. You can try um, Old Navy. I never shop at, I never really like, I shop at Old Navy, but like I never really bought any jeans from Old Navy personally. But like, uh, their jeans are good. Their jeans are expensive for one, but like they should have. They should at least have good sizes in Old Navy. What is the furthest I've ever been in from been away from home? I don't know. I travel a lot. I don't, not even that. Like I go out a lot, but like, not. I don't know. Are you a morning person or a night person? I'm a night person. I told you that already. Um, what is the first thing you do when you wake up? The first thing I do is go on my phone. <laughs> I gotta see who called me, who texted me, all that, who snapped me, all that. Like, I don't do nothing else, but as soon as I wake up, go straight to my phone. All right, I think I'm not gonna answer no more because they have way too much questions on this, on this website right now. But... Thank you guys for watching and make sure you stay tuned for my next video. Maybe my next video is going to be a haul. I'm not quite sure, but it's a secret. So stay tuned, turn on your notification. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you don't hit that subscribe button, what are you doing? What are you doing, honey? You don't want to miss out on what I've been posting, what I'm going to post and all that. So stay tuned. Bye.